Hey guys, what up? It's Apex. Um, went to the dispensary today. They actually had some tincture on sale. Um, and it's the... Did I throw the box away? Or I'll call it in the bag. Um, links will be on the Instagram, but it's um, the iRest Tincture. Um, this is their one-to-one -one regular strength. So this is testing like a little under five milligrams of THC on both side THC to CBD. It's like around like 4.6 or whatever, like four, a little higher than 4.5, but um, CBD is like 2.02 .02 higher. So this is a, not a true one-to-one. -one. It's a little more CBD. Um, this is their eye rest if I didn't say that. Bottles glass, it's like a glass eye dropper bottle. Now, the dispensary told me they use MCT oil for this. Um, if you're allergic to coconuts or whatever that one, it's either grape or rapeseed oil, just please note that this can contain coconut and or other um, products that you can and might be allergic to, so please, ask your dispensary before you buy. If you have an allergy to coconut or any of those other two things I said, probably not for you, nor all any of the edibles in um, PA because they all use MCT. Um, MCT is, like I said, a coconut-based derived oil. Um, it has been proven to be good for the brain and it's used in keto diets, so. I have no problem with it. Um, usually, I hate just hate the taste of coconut, but you can't really taste it. And I've I, and I've had other tinctures that they do add flavor to. Um, oh my god, I had this full spectrum CBD the one time, and it was one of these. And it was a uh, higher CBD. It, it was just pure CBD full spectrum. It was like fifty per one ml, and it was peppermint. So. Hopefully the flavor of this ain't a deterrent. Um, I will state this, I am not high at all today, honestly. Right now I am s sort of starting um, detoxing actually. Oh, okay. I see. And um, the drop, the eyedropper is clearly labeled from 0.25 all the way up to 1 ml. Um, oh, and I do not have any food in my stomach either. So this is the first thing entering my body today. Um, it said it was one to one point five. Well, let's try one ml first because this is thirty. So, anyway. It's tasteless. It tastes like a. <laughs> it tastes like butter water. With a little bit of an aftertaste. And the reason why I do it under the tongue, it directly hits. Um, usually when I do tinctures. I drop it under the tongue and then swish it around in my mouth so my whole mouth is covered. Then I swallow. Um, that's what she said. <laughs> but, um.
Hmm. I'm gonna do another little dip. Dip, I mean drop of this. I'm probably gonna do one more ml. So I figure my dosing for tinctures and stuff is usually two mLs if I really need it. I had to watch because this has CBD in it. Okay, there we go. And like I said, this bottle is glass. And when you don't have the dropper on it, it is prone to spilling. So be very, very careful when you're doing this. As I almost spilled the fucker. Anyway. I don't know. There's just something different about taking edibles like this. It's I, marijuana is not supposed to be in pill form. <sighs> All this BS. Can I just get a brownie or something? Seriously? That I don't have to bake in my own house? Hell, I would take gummies. Wow. Are you kidding me? All right. How many minutes are we in? And I only did like one drop before I did this one. Well, I'll say this. It's fast acting. It cut my craving down a little bit. So, usually like this stuff takes like an hour or two. I'm already feeling it. Um, I guess I'll come back to you guys when I'm not, when I do a little more testing on the oil, um, and every few products I might, like, talk about how I'm using it or something like that, because, um, I still have the Moxie Peach Tea, I believe, right? Yeah, the Moxie Peach Tea to review, so, um, this is more of, like, oh, it was, it was cheap, might as well get it. And for 30 mLs, that's a lot of liquid, just so you guys know. Even though the dosing is low, it's quantity that sort of matters anymore. Because for 26 bucks, I can only get like a, like a quarter gram cart. You know, maybe if the, if the flour is on sale and it's the CBD stuff that I like, it's like, in, what, like... I've seen them range from like nine dollars gram and they have some like and whatnot. Yeah, still. Two grams of weed technically were half that for a lot more than I paid. That's honestly a good deal, I would say. So I paid twenty-five dollars for this. I don't know how much it retails for. I had to look that up, but um I will say this. This cut down my craving and helped me, you know sort of mellow out. Hmm.
Anyways, guys, this has been Apex. On to the next review. Peace.